Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Firstly, I want to thank all my viewers and subscribers for your love and support. And it is because of your love and support today I am just a few steps away to reach my thousand subscribers. So please do keep supporting my channel and if you are new here, please do like, share and subscribe. So let's quickly start today's vlog. This morning I'm in our village cemetery and yesterday unfortunately one of our brother he passed away just a small kid he was only 13 years old a very good and a humble guy a guy who everyone loved but but unfortunately he passed away he passed away so suddenly and still now we cannot believe that he is no more with us. It was a very sudden death. So our life is so uncertain. We never know what the future lies ahead of us. Today I want to tell all my viewers to live your life in a good way. Be humble, trust God and enjoy every moment of your life. And all the best for that. So in today's vlog I want to show how we usually make the gravestone here in the village. These are natural stones which we used to bring it from the uh, forest and from here from the cemetery it takes around 30 mi minutes to the place where these stones are. So this uh, carrying of stones this is a very old tradition here in our village and I'm sure in most of the Naga villages uh, this tradition is still there so what we usually do is that uh, whenever someone dies uh, after all the funerals and uh, work is done we used to uh, go to the forest and then uh, search for a good stone a graveyard stone and used to bring here in the cemetery and over the stones we used to write the names of the person uh, who has passed away so uh, today we are going to do that we have brought the stones so we will be writing the names over it so do keep watching you can see on the back of me there are some stones these are very old ones uh, i will be showing some of them so do keep watching till then enjoy so these are the stones here we have one let's see this is on 16169 means this stone was put here in 1969 yeah so this is a very old one before i was born this stone was here Some of the stones here are artificial but most of the stones they are natural stones here also we have a big one this one is not very old 2192 it was this one is on 1992 yeah but very old 92 almost 30 years Same one, this one is also 92, 1992, very old. This one is a very big one. Let's see the size, it's one, two, three, up. So you can just imagine how big it is. This was carried all the way from the forest. Here also we have another big one. <laughs> uh. 
Yeah, this one is on 1994. Yeah. Asu means birth is on 1965 and died on 1994. Over here also, it's a very old one. This one is on 69, 1969. Yeah, very old. So these stones, these are all natural ones, except some of the stones here. So this, all the stones, these were carried all the way from the forest by our forefathers and some of them were also carried by the boys here. So these are the stones. Some of the stones are very old. And some of the stones are very big also. Just imagine how our forefathers they carried all the way up to the village. So this is it. Yeah, uh, this is a very old one. It's written here. Twenty three fifty five means nineteen fifty five. So this is almost 50, 80 years old stone. And as you can see, here on the gravestone, this one is a Bible, and over there, there is a cross. Cross and the Bible, both of it has different meaning. And Bible here signifies that this person is still not baptized when he or she pass away. So uh, we used to Buddha Bible in the gravestone and those who have the cross they are already baptized. So that's the symbol and that's how we used to uh, signify it on the gravestone. ก็เลยนะเออมันเก็บมาสั้นทําให้ได้ครับเออเออเออเออเออเออเออเออเออเออเออเออเออเออเออเออเออเออเออเออเออเออเออเออเออเออเออเออเออเออเออเออเออเออ